another thing that I want to point out here is that when you make this angle, that 30 degree angle, the, that angle should go from the hip bone to this hip bone. All right. And what I see a lot of times is people will put this angle in and it's way back here and it's this steep. That's not correct. This angle comes all the way up to this bone. When you do this, you make your dog look longer. Okay. And the other thing is there's not supposed to be this big point on their butt. Okay. Uh, people got to doing that in the show ring when they were trying to take away from something that was going on in the front. It was, but it, when you look at that and you look at a dog and all you can see is that point, that's not balanced, okay? That needs to be rounded off. Um, how much coat should be here? It says in the standard for a poodle and most every dog that if you draw a line from there to the floor, it should fall right in front of the back toe. So, you know, that's, she doesn't need to leave a lot of coat back there because he's pretty sound in the rear. So go on and set in your 30. Here's your point of your hip. But now you gotta remember when you do this and you're using the combs, you have to keep just the inside is going to touch the dog. This side's not. If you come, if you do it like this, you're gonna take off your hip and then your dog's gonna look very narrow unless you have a dog that's wider than he should be. Okay. And then come from the bend up to set in your other angle there. And she, when she picked up the leg, the bend is about there. I love this trick on everything. It, the, the, the comb will hit this bone right here and just pop right out. So it's really hard to make a mistake. And then go from the bend off the hock to set in that. Okay, 